Hello friends, welcome to the new video. Here we are going to learn about the what do you mean by the map state to props and map dispatch to props in very very simple language we are going to learn about it. Okay, so map dispatch to props means dispatch any event that you want to dispatch that will go into this dispatch dot props. That means whatever we have the uh, defined in the reducer, right? So whenever you call any API, right? So you have a function, uh, you have a function in the reducer and you want to call, right? You want to call it. So here you need to, uh, you need to send map dispatch to props and map state to props when it comes to the action, when your data is already set in the state and you want to retrieve that data, that map state dot props will be helpful over here. Let's take an example. Okay. So this is my CRUD app, right? So we have already have a demo on that. Okay. So here we have a map state dot props and map dispatch dot props map dispatch dot props means we have to call the API. When I click on the create, see create user have the API call, right? All the data of whatever they want to manipulate. So this is basically a API call full fledged API call is done in the map dispatch to props of whatever we have in the reducer so you can call it over here okay and in the map state dot props is basically setting the st uh, like whatever we have done with this state it and uh, if you want to retrieve the data from the state that will come into the action map state to props so it's basically state to props whatever the state you have it will convert into the props and you will use into your components very easily. So you can see that we have a loading, right? So here uh, in, in the props, I'm passing loading, right? So this, is, uh, this will convert into the state to props. Okay. So whenever we have a, so uh, whenever you call an API hit in the reducer, because in reducers, we are always calling the API hit, right? So in API, uh, if you want to do the API hit, go with the map dispatch dot props. And if you want to, uh, if API is hit, data is set, you want to retrieve the data from that state. So you can use the map state dot props. Okay. So this is the main difference between it. Okay. I, I hope you clarify that what is, what is exactly meaning of map state to props and map dispatch to props, right? Dispatch means action, dispa action dispatch, action dispatch, action dispatch you have to do and if you want to retrieve the data then come with the map state to props okay very easy very simple any query in that let me know in the comment section have a great day